Hey guys, what's up? It's Ari from Literary Gladiators, and today I'm going to be delving into a autobiography of a man who played a character that was so important to British culture and was written by one of the most wonderful authors of all time, one of the greatest mystery authors of all time. And this person played this character for a television show. The actor's name is David Suchet, and this is his autobiography about him playing Hercule Poirot. Um, so Hercule Poirot, of course, is the detective character created by Agatha Christie um, in like the, you know, the, the 20s, the 30s, the 40s, you know, the mysterious affair at Styles and the death in the clouds and the hollow and elephants can remember and the clocks and all those other wonderful stories that Poirot had been a part of, you know, Murder Roger Ackroyd, which we talked about on the channel at one point. So this book is about David Suchet. Now David Suchet is a, a really good British, um, he's kind of a stage actor, but he's also a method actor. So when he is really into a character, he will play it exactly the way. And the way that you see David Suchet play Poirot in the Poirot television show, which aired from the mid 80s all the way until 2013, um, he plays it wonderfully. And I've always wondered to myself, like, well, what kinds of stuff was going on behind the scenes? What kinds of stuff was he going through in his life at the time? So that is what he wrote this book about. He wrote this book to kind of explain how the things were behind the scenes, how he kind of found his way into finding the character and then being cast as the character and how he felt when he did his first season, how he felt with a lot of the episodes, how he felt about his cast, specifically his closest cast. There are actually um, pictures in here of different cast members and different events that happened and different episode clips and behind the scenes photos as well. But of course you've got Suchet's supporting cast. This is Pauline Moran who played um, Miss Lemon, and over here you've got Prof uh, you got Philip Jackson, who plays Inspector Jap, and then down here at the bottom, <laughs> down here is um, Hugh Fraser, who plays Captain Hastings. And there's also really cool photographs about his time when they had to reunite the cast for later episodes. Um, he kind of goes through all the episodes. One of my favorite anecdotes told by David Suchet in this book, and it's actually quite funny. He calls himself the Mango Man, and I think one time he went to see the Prime Minister, because obviously that's what happens sometimes when you are an actor and you're of high pedigree. He went to the Prime Minister, and he basically taught the Prime Minister the proper way to cut a mango. Um, and the prime minister was really was really interested. Maybe maybe they showed him how to cut a mango. It was something like that. But he was so interested in it. And that one of the episodes called the theft of the royal ruby, he actually took that that information and made a scene in the movie where he actually teaches the family he is staying with how to cut a mango. And it, it's quite interesting how you have some things from like real life, kind of find their way onto the small screen, which is quite interesting. Um, he also talks very much in depth, David, about um, the difficulties in having to leave the character. Obviously, we all know it's sad, but it's true. Poirot eventually passes away. And obviously that episode was one that the show eventually was going to do. And, you know, playing a character for such a long time with such closeness and gravitas and, and and just knowing exactly you know having it's like it becomes a part of you you know but David Suchet and Hercule Poirot are together as one so that is something that you have to take into consideration and he just it was really difficult for him to leave the show but in the end um, he does and he gives this whole experience here in the book. If you are a huge fan of Agatha Christie, if you're a huge fan of the Poirot television show, which used to be on Masterpiece Mystery, this is a book you're going to want to get. Where can you get this book? 
I don't think you're going to find it at your local Barnes & Noble. I think this is a book you're going to have to go to Amazon for, as I think it was mostly published only in Britain. But to get a copy of it was something that I really wanted to do, and I do not regret anything reading anything in this book. I think it's not just about Suchet, it's about his wife, it's about his agents, it's about, you know, just his life in general, before, after Poirot, during Poirot, and, and how some things were tricky for him, and some things were smooth, easy, and fun. So that's kind of what the book is about, is a basic autobiography on this man who we know as Hercule Poirot. So, if you um, are interested in picking up this book, like I said, you can go to Amazon and look up Poirot and me. Poirot and me. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for tuning in. Um, if you would like to see more videos like this and you'd like to see more group videos and other fun activities on Literary Gladiators, uh, make sure to support us on our Patreon as... The more you give us, the more we're going to be able to do a lot more fun activities, do a lot of great things for the channel, and continue to grow. Thank you for tuning in to our show today and my review of Poirot and me. And I hope you guys have a wonderful evening. Take care there.